Hi friends, I am Rakesh Kumar. I am from the from Tamil Nadu, the south part of India. Uh, so I'll be talk, I'll be talking in Tamil, one of the very ancient language. So now and the if the Ras or the basics about this all about basic na, chuma basics la, very basics. So our elementary, I am going to start Ras. So, what is the RAS learn? In the, in the side, south part of India, I am interested in robotics. So, we saw videos on YouTube, YouTube la video, paapon. so robo, pidi pannadu, pidi pannadu. so we will create a RAS. But, what do say? No? So, that is the video of RAS. So, RAS is a robot operating system. So, we Windows la, normal computers la operating system uh, Windows, Linux, Mac, Mac, all What it does, it will uh, uh, it, interact with the hardware and then execute the programs. Similarly, in the same way, for robot hardware uh, programs interact with the we can use a ROS. And in the RAS or terminologies, all the robotics is there. So it's a generalized system exclusively for robotics. And, and the, if, you, if you want to develop an automation system, or automation system create or a robo create all the So it has a full set of packages exclusive for robotics and automation system. In our period of issue, RAS is open source. So you don't need to pay money for working on the RAS. So that is a mega peri advantage. Uh, mega peri advantage and they provide facility for code reusability. So if you code and the code on the or research purpose kaga wo, one of the students uh, students execution kaga wo, use panna. If of course you can use it, you can slightly change the code and then you can do and produce the result. So this is an example of the church. Okay. So, RAS is a robot that is exactly fit. That's why you can see it. First. So, robot is a robot. It is a robot. It is a machine. It is intelligent. It is a robot. So, robot is nothing but an intelligent machine. Machine we have motors, drives, odometers, gyroscopes, sensors, camera, lidar, and lidar. So, this is a robot. This is a robot. So, a robot needs an intelligent to plan the path. For example, a self-driven car, I got to start from here to go to that. So, how to plan the path. And of course, I will not allow an obstacle to avoid. And you should know where, where you are going to reside. For that, you should have localization and mapping algorithms. For a trajectory track, a formation, Autonomous, Tanichia, Nane, Undu, Ingadu Ponam Nalo. We need intelligence. And all this intelligence can be built using RAS. Interesting article. So, Pakla, Wanga RAS, if you work. So, RAS in Rather or Linux platform Nala, number Windows terminologies, Windows terminologies la, other language irka. So, other motto on the terminologies motto number clear a land monitor, RAS, we can master it. So, RAS is basically a service oriented architecture. So, what is it? One service service. What is it? Service is what is it? If you activate it, you will get the work done. You will get the same value. So, there are a small modules. We call functions in normal programming language. So, in these modules, you have to activate it such that the given work is done. Okay. So, you have to activate it such that the given work is done. So, in the notes, what is it? Uh, whichever the node is publishing or publish na enna pannona or message anupanu or message send pannu for example idu or sensor ah irukalam so i can call this as publisher so or keyboard ah irukalam or sensor ah irukalam whoever is sending a message is called publisher and whoever receiving the message is a subscriber so ivanga rendu peru pesradhukku or pipeline venum illa or medium venum illa and the medium ku pere topic so ivula da so, this is clear that you can see the RAS. So, a publisher who will send a message, 
and subscriber who will receive a message and the medium of communication is topic so through messages you can invoke this services on the subscriber okay for example the subscriber on the motor wheel are kalam so i'll send a message or a command to run the wheel so always a and the service and i invoke pen right okay good yeah thank you